Greetings, brothers and sisters, and welcome to Another Point of View. This is Tuesday of Holy Week, and our focus today is Christ as the servant of the Lord. We're going to look at Isaiah 49, uh, which talks about uh, the prophecy of the servant of the Lord coming. Uh, this is what it says. Listen to me, O coastlands. Pay attention, you peoples from far away. The Lord called me before I was born. While I was in my mother's womb, he named me. He made my mouth like a sharp sword. In the shadow of his hand, he hid me. He made me a polished arrow and a quiver, and he hid me away. And he said to me, you are my servant Israel, in whom I will be glorified. But I said, I've labored in vain. I have spent my strength for nothing and vanity. Yet surely my cause is with the Lord, and my reward is with God. And now the Lord says, who formed me in the womb to be his servant, to bring Jacob back to him, and that Israel might be gathered to him, for I am honored in the sight of the Lord, and my God has become my strength. He says, it is too light a thing that you should be my servant, to raise up the tribes of Jacob and to restore the survivors of Israel. I will give you as a light to the nations, that my salvation may reach to the end of the earth. Thus says the Lord, the Redeemer of Israel and his Holy One, to one deeply despised, abhorred by the nation, the slave of rulers, kings shall see and stand up, princes, and they will prostrate themselves. Because of the Lord who is faithful, the Holy One of Israel, who has chosen you. God gave his servant Christ as a light to the nation. Jesus is God's light to the nations that salvation may reach to the ends of the earth.